what's up everyone savage here uh real quick uh impromptu shave and uh we're gonna review a piece of gear real quick so that piece of gear we're gonna be reviewing Ooh, look at this i love this little nice magnet opening alien shave three piece double edge this is very very generously provided to me by um reed aka live up straight aka shave cave thank you so much for hooking me up with this awesome piece of equipment brother and uh told him he promised me i promised him if he sent me one he uh, actually asked me if i uh you know just send you one to do a review on it which i'm going to kindly do I'm going to make this a quick video actually right now i'm loading up a razor into it i'm going to be me a blade i'm going to be using the astra blue which is probably my favorite blade on the market right now and uh you know minimal overhang it's you know, just that's the right sweet spot right there. You know, I don't like a super heavy amount of overhang, but this right here is a good sweet spot. I like that. And honestly, the handle too. This, this reminds me of like a barbell. You know, the Savage is all about you know, you know, picking up heavy things, putting them down. You know, get some weights clanging and nuts hanging, right? Clang and bang. So we're gonna be using. Very very excited to try this stuff right here. Samurai Malian Jade. Love the scent. It's like a teakwood cherry blossom. I think they said. Very, very masculine. You can see the color. Glycerin-based puck. Uh, Glycerin-based soap. And, uh, well, we're just gonna go full sing with it. We're using Smiles for Miles Synthetic, 26 millimeter monster. And, uh, honestly, I'm gonna do this in the spirit of, uh, the lather which turns out today. I'm just gonna go straight from soap to face. Now I'm gonna bother with another bowl because I gotta keep this up. It's a quick video. And,. I did not go ahead, I am. I did not, um, put my sink water up first, so I gotta deal with that right now. So, hope everyone had a good weekend. Um, so, some more information on the giveaway. Um, this week, I will be going to my barber. I know I said last week, but this past week was. Mm -mm. I thought I locked the door. I could have swore I locked the damn door. that uh fill up real quick i need to get a better lock i think you locked it when you really don't but uh we'll be heading down this week i'm gonna be getting the um item for the giveaway i'm gonna try and find well i don't know which one i'm gonna go for i know they got quite a bit down there and we're gonna go from there and that's probably good enough right there get the brush nice and wet and I'm just gonna start Why you like me? <laughs> just get a really good lather built up the smell gets even stronger as I go with it No skin off my ass, I was putting it on my face anyway. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, put this right on the face. It's going everywhere. Mm, right up the nose.
I mean, I messed with this one today, didn't I? But it's all, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. So, uh, all right, let's get this one started, shall we? I'm uh, gonna keep this quick, so I'm gonna start. All right, good glide, good glide. Soap itself, quite awesome. That uh, the scent is definitely very pronounced under my nose and in my nose as well. Excuse me. I'll get it out of there later. I've got the blooper right there, soap right in the nose. All right. So I really do like the, uh, the blade angle of this. It's very, I wouldn't say it's aggressive. It's mild, but it's cutting like an aggressive, but it's not feeling like an aggressive blade, which is really good. And so far, even going against the grain on the first pass. It's not dragging, it's not tugging, it's not pulling. And the handle is just beautifully holding up, which, like I said, reminds me of a barbell and very critical of grip. So, yeah, it's just very, it's a very, you see it's a straight up, if you look, it's a diamond pattern, kind of like a barbell or something like that would be. Excuse me. All right. Be as careful as I humanly possibly can. I'm not, actually, I'm not even gonna. I'm not gonna hit against on the lip. Gonna go with, but I don't want to cause some irritation because as soon as I'm done with this, I take my happy little ass out and mow the lawn in the heat, and uh, I'm really not. Trying to get any. God, I got that soap everywhere. Irritation. Still got a lot of soap. I, mean, I could go for a second pass really quick, like. Let's see what I can work with here. Oh, yeah. yeah. I can go for a second pass, I think, just to fine tune everything. There we go. Yep, really good, really slick. <laughs> I feel like I'm 13 again, applying a canned goop or canned foam. <laughs> but I know it's not, so it's good, I suppose. All right, let's do it real quick. Second pass, just as. I don't want to waste the product. And this will also get any stragglers I missed. Well, Gina, you know, that, that does happen from time to time. I don't think there's any, ever really anything that's a perfect shave on your first pass, like one perfect shave in general, but you can always try. That's what I'm doing right now. sink plug yeah this is a really good razor uh absolutely do love it already it's very it's like a mild aggressive razor it's 
like it cuts like an aggressive one, but it doesn't like feel like an aggressive one. So absolutely love that. The soap itself is absolutely amazing. Anything I'm anything mainly in shade is amazing. Like and does uh, gonna shock all of you, but I'm not I'm not gonna use a matching aftershave splash with that one. Uh, Reason being is I just have a lot done with you. This soap was very kind of gifted to me by uh, Reed, my other Webster Shave Cave, where you just identify him as. I like to think he's my homie, so I can call him. I, I like to think he's a pretty good homie of mine now, so I call him Reed, you know, first name basis, respect kind of thing, you know. This is the thing in the here we do, we, you know. But, you know. But yeah, like I said, I don't have the uh, matching aftershave splash to go with that one. So I'm gonna go. Whew. Yeah, I, I seriously have got to have a problem with anything Alien Shapes has ever uh, released. And this is uh, no exception right here. This is, you know, let me clean out the inside of the tub so it dripped. Also, I just love that damn artwork too. That is just, that is gnarly right there. Go ahead and cap it back on up. And that's definitely gonna be a mainstay right there. this video up with some aftershave after I wet the old face real quick and clean off a little bit. <laughs> Kids are right today. Alright, aftershave, I'm going. I'm going old school. Anyone recognize that lid? Yeah, you, you boys, you boys from that English leather right there. That is, of all the you know, old school, original old school drugstore after shaves. <laughs> That's probably my favorite one right there next to uh, Aqua Velva. I love that one so much, I actually have to order it online because it's my favorite. I think my uh, grandfather used that one. One of my grandfathers did. My dad's, dad's dad did. But, all right, that is it on that. All right, so, overall thoughts about these right here? Yeah, I like them both. They are both amazing. Reed, thank you so much for sending these out to me. Uh, it's very greatly appreciated. And uh, keep an eye out. Next bit I do will definitely be 100% about the giveaway. It's going to be announcing it. We're going to go over the terms once I figure those out. But that's all I got for you guys today. I got to get off here at the moment long before my dad gets here. But I wish y'all a happy Sunday. Uh, no, tomorrow's Monday. Hey, like I always say, wake up, kick Monday in the dick, right? Let's get it done. All right, wish you a savage sign it off.